hey what's up guys welcome back to another video so today we are going back to the season 7 competition and i know i covered the season 7 finals competition which is absolutely the best if you guys haven't watched it the link is in the description with the number one opa play player jaja you know currently three-time champion but there has been a lot of matches that happened before like the group stage matches and the preliminary matches and some of these matches are actually pretty insane and i picked out a few of them and we're gonna react to them and just showcase the gameplay bro these matches that i picked are like amazing so it also includes the number one opfp player obviously his performance is insane so we're gonna look at some of these matches and react to them so without further ado let's get into this video okay so first match uh i chose from one of the group stage matches and this is up against uh the number one lp player uh jaja and jaja here choosing mihawk ryuma as well as kobe and helmeppo he chose two of the really good s tier units especially a top tier s unit kobe and Melpo. dual units pretty annoying as well as the other guy he chose Jozu, another top tier, S tier unit, bro. Like, honestly, this match was insane because both of their uh, gameplays with the S tier units are just amazing. So, they also chose, the other guy chose Jinbei as well as Ace. Ace being a really OG unit. And as well as Mihawk, but Mihawk did get a buff. Uh, so, let's just see how this plays out. And, yeah, man. We're gonna see some insane gameplay right here. We got Mihawk up against Ace. Mihawk with the extra card. Ace with the extra card, but disrupted by the partner skill. We got the first skill. Basic attacks. Got the sub skill in right away. Doing that damage. And Ace. What's really good about Ace is that second skill. You just have to spam that, get that damage in. You could just walk around. But he's going all in with the attacks right here. He even used the uh, partner skill to get the combo in. Second skill again. Look at that. Putting that damage in. Mihawk escaped. Mihawk's trying to get an opening right here. Couldn't with the special from Ace to finish this off. This was a clean run. From Ace, Jaja struggling here with Mihawk, and that's a surprise. That's a surprise right there. But Kobe and Helmepo, bro, annoying dual units. That's it's insane, bro. Look at that nice dodge. Second skill. We got Helmepo. Avoided that uh, Zoro partner skill. Dealing the damage here. Nice right there. So he's trying to set up right now with Helmepo. Let's see if he's gonna do a switch. Nope. Still got it. See you can't you can't really escape after you have that flow with Kobe and Helmepo. It's just It's just destruction right here, bro. It's literally you can't escape. Look at that. Had to use the first skill to get away, but we got the extra card. Oh no! The partner skill. Elmepo connected real nice and avoided the partner skill. This is over. Chaja with Kobe and Helmepo is just scary. Alright, this is what I want to see, bro. Josu, a top tier S unit, up against Kobe and Meppo. Look at this. Popped off the Miss Golden Week shield, could not handle that damage. Still going with the attack right here. Again, Jozu. But failed the combo right there. Got him with the second skill. Look at that red armor. Basic attacks here. Ah, uh, disrupted by the partner skill. Ah, uh, Kobe was trying to attack, but combo failed. Second skill. Got the extra card. Shield, but went straight into the ultimate. But this won't do that much damage because the shield was there. 
So Jozu needs to try get an opening. Nice dodge right there. Second skill. And that speed on the second skill is insane. Let's go! Oh, nope. Couldn't connect there. Yo, look at this. Look at this. Tr look at these movements. Both are trying to get an opening. Let's go. Let's go right here. Avoided the partner skill. We have the ultimate. Let's go. Both. Both of the guys using the ultimate. That's nice. You already know. We have to... Like, it, we have to get rid of this Kobe Mepo, or it's been, or it's gonna be crazy. Second skill, it's over. Jozu coming in. Alright, up against Ryuma. Extra card from Jozu. Partner skill, Ryuma coming in. Nope. Jozu with the dodge. Ryuma, let's go. Coming in first skill. Basic attacks. I finally broke. Second skill. Let's go. Sub skill. And finally finish him off. Oh my god. Ryuma. Coming in. Second skill. Can he connect? No, he cannot connect. Shinbei trying to find an opening right here. Nice dodge right there. First skill from Ryuma failed right there. Second skill. Oh, look at that dodge from the Rayleigh partner skill. That's just some crazy observation hockey, bro. Yo, look at that. Okay, nice dodge. Oh, failed the combo. Failed the combo right there, Jinbei. Yo, look at that. Ryuma trying to get an opening. Jinbei with the parry. Red armor. Basic attacks going in. Let's go. Oh my god, bro. We got the partner skill. Disrupted it. I think he popped out the Rayleigh skill as well. He dodged that. We got the special stunt. He gets that extra damage going in. Let's go. Let's go. Second skill. Is it over? Oh my god, an ultimate. Yo, it's an alt finish. This is why I love this round, bro. Insane performance. Crazy. Alright, next match. This match is from the group stage matches that I picked. And this was actually pretty close, bro. Like, both guys. I mean, this, this match is featuring the number one OPFP player, right? Both of these guys were insane. They were so close. So... Number one OPAP player Jaja is choosing Gear 2 Luffy, Senta Maru, as well as Ashura Zoro. Good team right there. You guys already know a pro Gear 2 player switching between Gear 2. Insane speed, right? The other guy chose Blackbeard, Ryuma, as well as Perona. Perona making an appearance in this competition, which is really interesting. She is a ranged attacker, right? So, this match is really looking good. We got Perona up against Ashura Zoro. Perona with that first kill. Look at these ranged attacks. Real nice. Avoided that Beppo skill. The basic attack is, al is also ranged. Nice dodge right there, but Ashura Zoro get caught on that basic attack. First skill from Ashura Zoro. Connected real nice. Avoided that um, partner skill, but couldn't get the combo in. Ah, but the Beppo skill disrupted it. He's trying to switch into three sword style. Let's go. Perona trying to avoid all his attacks right here. Second skill from Perona. Got him with the basic attacks. Ranged attacks are amazing. So I think that was the extra card or the special. I think that was special. Beppo. That's that real nice. Look at that. He's trying to get an opening to get the basic attack in. Look at that dodge. Nice dodge right there. Ashers are really looking, trying to get an opening right here, bro. He got it. Let's go. Special. Free sword style. Aw, oh, disrupted it by the Soro skill. Got him. No, could not connect. 
Ashra Zoro needs to get an opening. Look at these rage. Oh my god, Perona! How many dodges does Perona have? It's over. Such calculated dodges is insane. Oh my god. This is insane, bro. Next up, we got Sentamaru. Second skill. Sentamaru. Trying to get avoid those basic attacks right there, but you can't. Sentamaru with the red armor. Look at that red armor. It's impossible. Okay, we got Ryuma up against Sentamaru. Damn, nice dodge from Ryuma. First skill, Sentamaru coming in strong right here. Second skill. Another first skill, parry. Moria partner skill. Yo, look at that transition. I got disrupted from that partner skill. Got the axe. Ryuma is powered up with that special. Second skill. Second skill again. Let's go. First skill. Yo, look at this combo. Real nice. Sentamaru putting in that damage. Second skill again. Nice dodge right there. Ryuma needs to try to get an opening. Let's go. Second skill. Basic attacks right here. Sub skill. Nice. Look at that, man. Both are at even health. Sentamaru trying to uh, get that first skill. Second skill from Ryuma. They're both trying to get an opening to finish this off. Second skill. Yo, look at that dodge with the special from Sentamaru. Yo, look at this. This is what I call. This is what I call such an insane gameplay, bro. That's such a pro play. Oh my god. First skill. Charger Sentamaru is just insane, guys. Got him again with the first sec and second sc Yo, <laughs> look at that red armor, guys. <laughs> Literally one HP left and finally Blackbeard finished him off. Ah, uh, this is gonna be insane, guys. Gear 2 going in straight. I avoided that attack from uh, the Tachigi partner skill, or it would have been a, uh, it would have been crazy. Special right away. Got stunned. He's just waiting and chill. Oh, he failed. He failed. Oh my God, guys, he failed. <laughs> Jaja failed so completely. You could have gotten that. Second skill. Let's go. Ah, the Toshigi skill did not come through, but still, he's getting in the combo with. With the special, it is over, Jaja, finished. Alright, so this next one is from one of the group's A matches, and we have two teams right here. One team is with Aokiji, Sentamaru, and Kuma. You know, pro players are always choosing Sentamaru because you guys already seen the gameplay for Sentamaru. He's fast, a lot of red armor, he's just such a good pick. As well as the other guy right here with Ivan Kov, Summer Nami, my personal favorite, a ranged attacker, as well as Ashura Zoro. Three sword style, two sword style, we're switching between different type of skills, you guys know it is. We got Ashura Zoro up against Kuma. Kuma with second skill. Nice extra card right there from Kuma. That was actually pretty nice, but Asher Zoro filled the combo right there. Look at these dodges from Kuma. Couldn't get it there. Three sword style from Asher Zoro. Sub skill, basic attacks right there. And broke. Went back straight into two sword style. Got more skills in. Nice dodge right there from Kuma. Second skill. Extra card. Block. Oh, look at that! Look at that transition! That was super quick. Going from that special to avoid that Blackbeard skill. Man! We got that pause from the, the sub skill. Kuma trying to get an opening combo right here. 
But Ashra Zoro, nice dodges. Look at that, but the extra card blocked it. Going in with the ult finish. This Kuma. This Kuma with these dodges are just insane. Damn. We got Summer Nami up here. First kill. I disrupted it from the partner skill right there. We got Summer Nami. Ranged attacker. Nice dodge right there. We got the extra card and the special. But Nami avoided that real good. Look at these dodges from Kuma, bro. Damn. Basic attacks right there. And they needed a partner skill to beat Kuma, bro. Kuma was insane. Alright, we got Sentamaru doing his thing right here. Throw the axe. Basic attacks right here. Nicely avoided that partner skill, but Nami's extra card. We got those clones. Avoided that partner skill as well. Oh, what happened right there? What happened? Somehow the combo failed. And Sentamaru coming in with the basic attack right here. Full control. Is he trying to get the axe? He got the axe. Avoided that extra card. I mean, the sub skill from Nami. Look at that. Another combo. Look at that red armor from Sentamaru, bruh. This is why Sentamaru is picked. He's just such a good S unit. Ivankov. Another. Second skill. Double tap. Ivankov trying to get an opening. Let's go. Ah, but the Shigi partner still disrupted it. Ivankov trying to get that combo in. Let's go. Basic attacks here. Nice. We got the heal. Yo, look at that. Nice. Yo, both of them dodged backwards, but Sentamaru got it in with the special. Double special. Double tap. Yo, that was. Alright guys, so hope you guys like these selected matches that I got from the Season 7 competition. All of these were like group stage matches. And even though it's a group stage match, you could already tell like these players are going up and beyond trying to get some crazy combo in. Because these gameplays are just insane. And the best thing about this is that they're going to put out more characters, right? We're going to get more characters in the future. And we're going to witness even more crazier things. Crazier combos. Like, I can't wait to compensate on all of that. And we're going to get more tournaments in the future. Season 8 tournaments and all that stuff. It's really exciting stuff, man. And if you guys like want to watch more of these... Um, commentary let me know i'll pick out a few more from previous competitions and just commentate on those but yeah man hope you guys like the video on to the next one guys